Hey guys, what's new? The Chalha here, and welcome to another video. So, if you have been watching the news recently, then you should know of a lady who has received a free house from HTC, but is now declining the house, because it is too far from Shagwanas, which is apparently where her children's school is. So today, I decided that I would listen to what she has to say, so brace yourselves, and let's hear what she has to say. This year's transport is very hard. I cannot leave to go anywhere because I do not know the area. Well, she can always ask for directions and she will eventually get to know the area over time. Now, we know we are big people and we suppose, uh, how to put it, accumulate yourself to the area. But I have four kids. Um, you may go somewhere, you, don't, you might not want to speak to anybody or you might not want to approach people because not everybody is people. But she has to start talking to people and get to know them so that they can help her. Um, the hardest thing is for me now is preparing for school for my kids. I have no one, I do not have a vehicle, not saying that I want the government to give me a vehicle, no, I don't want that. I need a location where I will be capable to, to move about with my kids in Shogunas where their school are located. Is she serious? I mean she already got a free house and now she is asking them to relocate the house. By the way, I don't think that her children are very keen to go to school. I do not want to have to be spending unnecessary money on transport and stuff like that. Well, if she thinks that school is necessary, then spending money on transport is also necessary. No one to that the government give me this hand to mouth. Not meaning that I want them to give me transport hand to mouth too. But didn't she just say that she didn't want a vehicle from the government? Um, but I just need a closer location so I will be able to see about my kids and my family better. Why doesn't she just send her children to a different school that is near to their house? They hand them out. The government is just hand them out. They just say things that they would do and will not do. Two years ahead, look at now get the house. Two years are back, I'm supposed to get it. So how long I will wait again? Vanity on the earth don't bother me. It don't hurt me. Money don't worry me. But didn't she just say that she doesn't want to spend unnecessary money? I gotta get something for the market. How would I reach there? I do not have a vehicle. I say once now. How would I reach? If I don't have money on one day, how would I reach to drop my kids to school? How would I? Good question. Well, did you know that you can steal a car? All you have to do is find the car with an open window, then unlock the door, open it, punch the driver if necessary, pull him out, get inside and drive off. Okay, I'm joking, but you can always get free PTSC buses for children in school uniform. Why would I do walk from Shagona there? Yes, if you're desperate then go ahead and walk, or you can ask this guy to carry you there. Because my kids attend Shagona's school in Shagona's. If I have no money to travel, what would I do? Walk? That making any sense? I don't think that making any sense. The government never make me, you know, and they will not break me. My mom make me. She did break me. She did not prepare anything for me. Wait, hold on. How did her mother get into this? I'm not asking the government to prepare anything for me. I will, I will pave my road for myself, and I will reach where I have to go. Okay then, it's her life. I guess no one can tell her how to live it. But anyway, thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe and like this video.